You are listening to The Diary of a Wannabe Writer, presented by Richard A. Boxshaw, in which I chronicle my life and attempts to become a professional writer by, you know, doing some writing. Daily. Hopefully. Hello and welcome to the podcast. I'm working hard today, so this is going to be very, very brief. Um, But I'd very, very quickly like to talk about how I use music when I'm writing. So obviously, because quite a lot of the writing I do now is live on Twitch, I can't really have music on in the background because I'll end up with a copyright infringement and too many of those and they um, and they buy your account, and I'd hate for that to happen because I really do enjoy writing on Twitch. Um, but when I wrote the English Hikikomori, which was before I discovered Twitch, I did music use music quite a lot, and I did actually build a playlist around that um, around that book, and it had lots of bits and pieces in it. Um, some of them are specifically referred to in the text of the story. I think there's a couple of, I think there's a Pet Shop Boys song um, that's about a funeral called Your Funny Uncle, which is, um, um, I think it's specific. I don't think I named the song, but it is specifically referenced in the book. Um, I, I, I use the Waltzing Matilda track from the, was it Australia? There's a movie called Australia. From the sound back, soundtrack of that, I use the Waltzing Matilda track. Um, but the big one that I, I thought of was a, a song called Everyone Say Everyone Says Hi by David Bowie, and I can't remember which album it's from, but um, it's it's an amazingly beautiful track, um, and it kind of encapsulated, kind of because because it's 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 about kind of it's about somebody having died. I think it's um, it's a very weird song, but it kind of felt thematically and lyrically like it could almost be about Freddy um, from English Ikikomori, um, to the point where if there was ever a movie, Delusions of Grandeur kicking in, I would want that final shot of Freddy um, being a kind of, no, I'd like kind of the shot of the, the hospital he's in, and needs to be a hospital by the coast, and then kind of like a drone shot coming out and then over the sea. Um, to the tunes of uh, Everyone Says Hi by David Bowie. But anyway, delusions of grandeur. But the other thing, um, and and this is why this podcast is going to be so short, um, I wrote a song um, whilst I was writing that book, um, and it's from the point of view of Freddie's tormented brain telling him to kill himself. And it's a very dark song because if you listen to it, it ends with with him attempting to kill himself. Um, But I'm really proud of it. I did all the music myself. Um, I wrote, obviously, the lyrics. Uh, I perform it. Um, So yes, this is a real (laughs) cop-out because I've only had to talk for two minutes and now I'm going to play you a song I wrote called Hikikomori, Freddie's Song. Um, I also use this as the intro, the countdown music. Um, When I go live on Twitch, um, I put like a card up for five minutes saying streaming shortly with a countdown on it. And this is the music I tend to play during that. I have switched it around a couple of times, but I always come back to this one. So yes, here is my song, Hikikomori, Freddy's Song. Tell me what to say 
tell me how you think I ought to feel You cannot keep me safe We'll discuss our terms and then we'll make a deal You make me overthink You hate me when I try to interact Could it be jealousy? One day I'll win the fight and that's a fact And yet my feelings inside say that you're right all along That I am better alone And yes it should be lifelong You cannot pick up the phone Cause I cannot play that part And if one day you did I would not know where to start Why do you want me to be? your agenda you want me to die alone on my own on my own on my own on my own Tell me how to die Tell me when the moment has arrived It's not a cry for help It's not a choice that feels at all contrived And as I feel my last pain, it's with some minor regret, I know we won't meet again. You have been listening to The Diary of a Wannabe Writer, presented by Richard A. Boxhall. Thank you for tuning in to my random ramblings, and if you'd like to know more about me or my projects, visit my link tree at linktr dot ee forward slash richard wright capital r capital w thank you for listening